Hi guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to update OpenCore and Kexts on your Hackintosh the easy way using OpenCore Auxiliary Tools. You generally want to make sure that you're using the most recent version of OpenCore and Kexts before installing macOS updates. The easiest way to do this is to use OpenCore Auxiliary Tools or OCAT for short. First, go to the OCAT GitHub page, which I'll link down below, and click Releases on the right. This will bring you to the download page for the most recent version. Scroll down until you see Assets, and then click the link for OCAT underscore Mac dot DMG to save it to your Downloads folder. Open your Downloads folder and double click the DMG file to mount it. Then, drag the icon into your Applications folder. Open your Applications folder, right click on the OC Auxiliary Tools icon and select Open in the menu. Then click Open again and OpenCore Auxiliary Tools will start. Now we need to mount our FE partition. At the top, click the third icon from the right labelled Mount ESP. You'll see a window appear with a list of your drives. Select your boot drive in the list and click Mount and Open config.plist. Then enter your macOS password and click OK. This will mount your FE partition and load the config.plist into OCAT. The first thing that you're going to want to do now is create a backup of your existing FE folder. Click the second icon from the right labelled Backup FE and a copy of your FE folder will be saved to your desktop. Next, click on the icon with two arrows labelled Upgrade Open Core and Kexts. A new window will open with your Kext files listed on the left and your OpenCore files on the right. To update your Kexts to the latest version, put a tick in the box next to each one or click on Select All, then click Check for Kext Updates. OCAT will check each one to see if there's a newer version available. Now you can click on Update Kexts and all of your Kexts will be replaced with a newer version. To update OpenCore, it's just a matter of clicking on Get the Latest Version of OpenCore, and after a few seconds, you should see a message saying that OpenCore has been updated. You can click OK to dismiss the message, and then close the window. Now, if you look at the top, there's a red circle with an exclamation mark. This means that OC Validate has found an issue with your config.plist. This usually means that the new version of OpenCore has added a new key or removed one or more obsolete keys. You can click on it for more information. In this case, we can see that OpenCore 0.8.9 has added a new key, Resize Use PCI RBIO. If you just click on the Save icon, the one that looks like a disk, then OCAT will automatically add this new key for you and save your config.plist. Now if you click the OC Validate icon again, we can see that the error is gone. Now you can just quit OpenCore Auxiliary Tools, reboot your Hackintosh, and you're done. After rebooting, you can update macOS as usual through the App Store, or by downloading the update from Apple servers. I hope this video helps. If you have any questions, put them down in the comments below, and I'll do my best to answer them. That's it for now, thanks for watching.